They sell them stickers and stuff because uh, I ran into a couple guys like that. Y'all ask my son who was he supposed to be and well, why. Who supposed to be? Do he look who this way? Who am I way? supposed to be? Ninja Vanish! Uh. <laughs> Did you hold just on, disappear? Hold on. Hold on. Uh. <laughs> what the what? Hey, hold on. Thank uh, 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 it. Uh, That's death right there. You can't come back from that. Ain't no coming back. Oh from my that. god. Ain't this, done. And then, this... and then I pull the eye up and it'll really be wrapped. So I don't got the eye contact in. But when I do, hold on. <clears throat> when I do, it's up. It's up for everybody at DreamCon, I promise. So this is DreamCon preparation, apparently. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Oh, I can't what enough. color is his hair? He has white hair. Listen, y'all. DreamCon is in Texas. And he so got funny. all this on. This nigga about to be hot than a zombie. <laughs> <laughs> I'll fight in any and all conditions. Woo! Do I got the head down upside down? Hold up. I might. I might. <laughs> I just feel so cold in this. Do y'all kids just invade y'all room like this? Like, I just feel so. I feel like I turn around and just. They are in my room, you know. And I, you know, I kill somebody with that. Really, I feel dangerous. Mm -hmm. You want to say something about me? You two people does not mean that. Mm -hmm. And who oh, are yeah. you gonna be, ma'am? Me. Lane. Not me. Not Kakashi. I tell you that. Wait a minute. So it's three days, and three. Uh, wait, it's three days. Already and high one of them was at the convention center. They all at the convention center. Yeah, that was my next question. It's three days in the same place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So three days doing the same stuff. Like No, it's different it. stuff every day. I'm, I'm pretty sure they have different events with different um you know people coming out. Nami where is gonna be there. Y'all don't know who that is, but Nami is sure don't. Black excellence. Black excellence. Greg's gonna be hot. <laughs> I'm already hot. I'm gonna be sweating like a pig. Yeah, cause I'm pretty sure it'd be like a line outside or something mm -hmm. like that. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be throwing chidori's at anybody way. Just you know. The whole uh, wait, way. why they couldn't just attach the arms to the vest? That'd be ghetto. Yeah, so the that hell. you wouldn't be so hot, cause you have on layers, bro. Like layers. That would be ghetto. And you don't even care. You just finna be high. I'm just finna be high. I'm finna be heated up. Like, oh my god. Like an oven. And you finna get all that attention just because your hair is naturally that way. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm trying to figure out. If I should spray it, spray it white, or if I should just rock it as like you know black Kakashi. His like hair is white. Tomorrow. You gotta pick you way up for it. Is it? it well, up. yeah, I would spray it. I'm a, I gotta send you a picture so you can edit it in. Silver. It's like white. Like, it's not even. It might be. It's like silver whitish. Color. But still, just add it in. Get a wig. That's what I'm thinking. Why? His hair is naturally that way already. Right. The wig is. is this low key cooler than. This colder than the wig because it's locks. Like, come on now. Yeah. Well, you know, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> oh, I I'm like I saw this little girl who posted a video. Mm. Guess what her video was titled? What was it? Dream Conference. Get ready with me for our first day of high school. <laughs> Guess how she many rich. views she got? She gonna be rich. She gonna be rich. Guess how many views she got? That was, that that video took her channel and blew her up. Of course. Three hundred thousand views. Kids love content creators. It's still not too late because you time. are going to college. So get ready with me. First day of college. It would be that simple. Too. Yes. Putting together fits. That right? her fits. That's what I'm saying. Her outfits be killing the game. She I missed know. four years of. Jazz could be right now paid. I ain't gotta work nowhere. This uh, is I don't I deny that I'd be a great influencer. You know I'm hilarious <laughs> and pretty and stylish. And, yes. Mm -hmm. I just don't have time. I just, uh, I just can't put it in the time. <laughs> Greg should totally spray his hair. I think That's what I'm saying. Things. What Wait. do you think? My man. Can y'all see the? Oh yeah, there he goes. There's the guy. Anyway, He's got white hair. Yeah. He's that guy. He is the guy. He's got white hair. He's got the Greg hair. Yeah, sure. 
<laughs> that's what he said. So that's their dream con in their dream. And their 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 ultimate dream is that their mom is gonna go to. So yeah. We'll see. I talked to my homegirls today. So apparently Hey y'all! Ooh, music, copyright. Hey! Hey girl, hey, hey boy. I don't know what's gonna be in this vlog, you guys. I just know that I need to go pick up some groceries, so I'm about to run to H-E-B. And yes, I will be in the old lady cart. I promise y'all I walk as less as possible, but I'm not finna lie and tell y'all I don't be walking. So let me explain. This is gonna be a Achilles tendonitis update. So arthritis, I'm good. It I, after like two days, that pain went away. I didn't even have to take the pain pills that they gave me, but once, as far as my Achilles, that's a whole. Oh, Coco with me, hi, girl. Don't judge her. She dressed I'm herself. In, I'm in shoes. I mentioned she. I was gonna buy her some shoes, and yeah. So now I'm not gonna hear the end of it until I do it. But anyway. Uh, yeah, so it's still painful, but I can walk. I just have a limp now, and the limp is because it's kind of hard to describe, but when my leg go back, you know, imagine walking. When the leg go back, I feel something pulling. So to avoid that that stretch, that tingle, it's like, it's like a pain, like a sharp pain to avoid that. I just don't even allow my legs to go back that far like that. So I kind of like walk with a limp or whatever. But I will change. I mean, everything can get better once I go and see the orthopedic specialist. I haven't had time. I haven't made time. Like, I've been, like, really working hard because Curtis is about to go into surgery. And um, I will be the sole provider for four to eight weeks something like that something like that what is it uh, i think like uh six to eight weeks something like that. okay right that part so i can't even take the time to just stop and go like so what i think i'm gonna do is um like after he have his surgery i'm gonna be like really sitting still and probably not going anywhere so i feel like that'll be a good time for me to make an appointment for that week um at least that first week so that's the update on that i do walk around during the day but when i go to the store i don't walk around i just okay i lied one time in walmart i did but i was like in a hurry and i felt like that cart wasn't gonna get me around fast enough but for the most part i do get in the electric carts and try not to use my legs as much as possible because some days it'd be hurting so bad and then that's when i know i did too much or whatever i also got me a compression sock for my ankle and i wore it and i felt like it felt good while it was on but when i took it off oh my god like yeah i gotta go see them people because i need to know what i'm doing but anyway curtis you didn't even say hi you just started talking <clears throat> hey y'all okay hey. curtis say hi so we're about to go to um i don't know why i feel like i'm sitting up so high in the seat yeah it do look like i know it lean back i know uh, i'm i'm okay i'm okay <laughs> um we about to go to H-E-B, grab some groceries. I need to go to Walmart too, but I don't know if I'm gonna do Walmart today. I, I might be asking too much of myself in one day. Tomorrow we got some exciting stuff going on, and it might be in this vlog. We are going to see Shaquille O'Neal at his new restaurant, and he better be there, cause period, we gonna be there on time, to see Shaq at his new restaurant. It's called Big Chicken. So, of course, I'm going to have the camera. Of course, I'm bringing y'all because cause what? Because what? Yeah, so we're all excited to go and do that. Unfortunately, Greg has to work, so he won't be rolling with us, but the rest of us will be there. Um, and we're going to bring y'all for along for the experience. But I'll see y'all at the grocery store, girl, because it's time to go.
I told Coco to take her bath and get her some clothes, and this is what she chose. <laughs> <laughs> you look cute. You look so cute, girl. Mommy! Come on. Let's get out of here. So, didn't pick up. <laughs> I didn't pick up much at HEB. HEB is a tad bit expensive today for whatever reason. They are, we gonna have to wait until we go to Walmart. But I did get, this is a pack of beef. Some kind of cheap steak. I'm sure I could figure out a meal with that. And then they had chicken. Oh, it's heavy. Okay, there you go. Some chicken drumsticks for 99 cents a pound, which is not that good of a deal, actually, to be honest. Coco, don't stare at people, please. Anyway, these people just, like, it's almost like they just want to they even had me listen to my conversation, but anyway. The drumsticks, they 99 cents a pound. You could get chicken thighs or drumsticks for 99 cents a pound, and it's not actually not all that worth it. So, I mean, I feel like the meat prices today is above the budget of HEB, so we are going to go to Walmart and finish up the rest of our shopping, but it won't be today. I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Because I'm a little tired. It's like 8 o'clock p.m. And I waited last minute to do this stuff. Oh, I did pick up some Lowry seasoning salt as well. I don't know. Cook them. And also, I need to make a list. Like, I feel like I just came to the grocery store because I know I needed to. But I need to make a list. So, I'm definitely going to do that as well. I have to pick up the stuff that I meal prep. Especially my, um, I've been making egg bites at home. Oh, I wanted to, oh, let me go see if they got the silicone pans I'm, I'll be looking for for my egg bites. The one I got out for Amazon is good. Hey, what is you doing? What is you doing? The one I got out for Amazon is good. But my egg bites is way too tiny. Like, they not egg bites, they egg bits. <laughs> they egg bits. Um, okay. I don't know where they kitchen stuff is. Maybe I need to see. If Walmart got it, cause I'm struggling, I'm struggling. I never buy like those type of things out of HEB, so I don't know which aisle is in. But I do have the HEB app. Let me check the app. I'll be right back. Do y'all see this? This is what we're dealing with right now. Oh my God. We gotta hurry up. And Ooh, get in the house. Got lying, babe. I did not get all of it. No, I'm talking about it's straight. It's straight. <sighs> oh my goodness. Get in a good show. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like fireworks. <laughs> Y'all hear that? That sounds so sexy, don't it? They do that. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. I got it. Okay, time to go. We got to go home, y'all. Bye. I hope nobody. Okay, you guys, here's a small little update. These are, look, they are not supposed to be touching the top. This is mint, so they're ready for me to start using already. If y'all notice, everything else is empty because they didn't do so well. They didn't grow up. Here is one of them here. I just don't know what happened, like, 
It's been too long and they didn't sprout up, but they did say that they will replace them if they don't sprout up. And yes, I want my money, so I am going to contact them for a replacement, and I hope they give me one. But what made me think about showing y'all this is because my light is blinking. It's time to add water. So, yeah, let me see. You see that? It's like, it's hard for y'all to see it, but... Also, these are my little green onions over here. Uh, ready. Ready to. They need water. But, y'all, one thing I'm not really feeling about it is, if I could just be honest, this little green stuff is starting to form inside. And I don't know why. Like, is this what it looks like in the bottom of a garden? Like, I don't know if that's normal or not because yeah I don't know and then it's like this little white stuff I have to keep like cleaning it and they do tell you to, to like pour it out to pour the water out put fresh water in and I'll be doing that and it got a filter in there and I clean the filter and everything but I don't know but this is just giving y'all a quick little update y'all see my mints it looks good they look so good i need to make me a, a what they call them uh, um see the light is burning it i need to make me a, a um mojito that's what i need to make Yeah, it's time for me to clean this out. I'll do it uh, another few days. I got other stuff to do. <laughs> hey, y'all. Thank you. They not finished making y'all's yet? Oh, okay. Okay. Hey, y'all. Hey, girl. Hey, hey, boo. Hey. Curtis just went and got my Starbucks. So we just made a Starbucks stop, you guys, because we haven't eaten breakfast yet. We've been getting ready all morning. I am super duper excited, y'all. We are about to go see Shaquille O'Neal at his new restaurant. And I'm hoping and praying. Oh. I'm hoping and praying that we are able to see him and that we don't have to wait long because it's hot. It is really hot today. I think... I think it's like a hundred degrees today or more. But I get the kids' reaction when they get to the car, y'all. We super, super, duper, duper excited. I, I haven't done anything with my kids in a while, so I'm happy about this. Um, it's only for three hours, but the name of the restaurant is called Big Chicken. And so we gonna try it out as we always do. Y'all know every time new stuff come, we are quick to try it. So, hey y'all like my makeup? I did a very light beat. I mean light, light beat. Cause this is what. And the messed up part is, I didn't even put on any setting spray. So if I start looking crazy in this vlog, y'all man, y'all business. Don't judge me, okay? Jazz setting spray all day. She hooked herself up. But me, I wish my baby would vlog, y'all, because she on her way to a parade with her friends or whatever. And I told her, like, she just she just won't vlog. I don't I don't I don't know. I don't know what else I need to do. That was the only reason I told her I would buy her iPhone if she vlogged. And she she never did. But I ain't gonna lie, I didn't pressure her too much. Uh, but that was the deal. That was the only way she was getting that phone. But I ain't pressure her too much. I told Curtis to get the get a big cup of ice water. They cheated you. They still gave you that that's this size. See? Here got my girls. Dang, you right in the way. I'm trying oh. to see the girls. Okay. 
Hey, what you get, Chad? <laughs> Matcha tea latte, Percy's. And what what's yours called? Strawberry Frappuccino. Jumbo Bonsino. Period. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ready to go see Shaq? Yeah. Kurt, did you ready to go see Shaq? Yep. Shaq and Diesel. Mm, Lord. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> that's where we headed, and I gotta go because I'm the driver. <laughs> it's all the way back there. Where? All the way back Big chicken, we here. It's Shaq. Girl, come on, what you thought? Oh, we that line is long, but that's okay. We here, we made it. Big chicken, we here, we made it. And look at the line down there. Oh, that's the line down there. I sent the girls to go get in line down there while I go check on the other things of the things. I know. <laughs> It's zoomed 
as y'all can see, I got a little footage with Shaq. I mean, of Shaq. It's too crowded. It's too many people. It's too much ratchetness. Why I have to get into it with a little girl? The ratchetness is real, okay? And it was definitely in the building. This These people are out here with babies in strollers and will be the first one crying when your baby is unalived from being trampled. Like, why would you put your baby in this situation? People are squeezed in and everything. Like, and then she, I'm trying to get to my husband. That's even worse. Y'all both dumb? Like, y'all both dumb. I said, let it go on past me. Well, her baby was struggling. Like, damn, she just jumped in front of me. She literally They pushing. are literally pushing these babies and in strollers. Like, it's not. For me, if I just had to see Shaq or whatever I was trying to do, Ugh. babe, you stay here with the baby in the stroller. I'll be right back. I'm going to squeeze through, take some pictures. Give me your phone. I'm going to take pictures on your phone, my phone. Like, it's not like you going in because these are windows on the side of the building. This is not the door entry to get in. You just getting a picture. You're and get then people just standing there like for fun. Like nobody was even eating. In the inside? Nobody. There was one lady at the bar sipping her drink. But everybody else. Oh my God. <laughs> so everybody's going to be here forever. And the festivities in at three. Shaq yeah. Yeah, Shaq is out of here. That's not finna last that long. That's crazy. It, it was it was bananas. Gonna go, no, because it literally wraps around that entire building all the way to Walgreens. Uh, and that's exactly why I sent Jazz and Coco to get in the end of the line. And I went to go see what was going on with the festivities. And then I called my baby like, y'all need to come back up to the front because it's not that deep. We'll come back and try to fool another time. But um, as far as seeing Shaq, let's try to get us some pictures. Jazz was in the right place to get pictures and videos. I went and found her, got my pictures and videos, and I'm gone. And then at the front door, Jazz, when you and Coco was standing over there waiting on us it sounded like somebody was fighting yeah, yeah. it sounded like multiple people was getting into arguing they're yelling <laughs> and fighting and it's just like i said oh black people like i'm sorry y'all <laughs> i love my people but i don't do well with the ratchet and the the ghetto like i just don't y'all gonna have to be mad at me <laughs> because I just don't get do well with it and I call myself Bougetto. Like you can be classy and pop off when it's time, but it ain't time. What is y'all doing? Why are you fighting? Cause Sha you can't see Shaq? Like <sighs> okay, we about to go. We came, we saw, we tried. Jazz finna get ready for the parade. So I gotta go drop her off to her friend's house and then um we all are still hungry because the plan was get something from Starbucks and then come get something to eat from here. I feel like the the way that they're doing this is not right. Uh, when B Love did a lot, did her thing, mm -hmm. you was in and out. You had to buy your food first, oh, yeah. then they had her at the back, take a picture with her and leave. Oh yeah. So it was constant rotation for everybody to to, to see yeah. her. Mm -hmm. I don't understand why they're not doing that here. Yeah, but it's almost like, I don't even know. Cause y'all ain't even making no money. Everybody outside, the money is outside. Mm -hmm. And and these wretched people rolling these strolls with the babies probably didn't plan on spending no money anyway. Mm -mm. <sighs> well, let me go cause the ratchet people gonna be mad at me <laughs> and i don't care because get your life together sis i hope you're watching this video a baby in a stroller it's not safe like i said anyway yes i do need the address jess thank you very much okay but yeah you know because me and my daughter out here looking cute and my coco looking like a princess and curtis looking all handsome we ain't out here ratchet the girl was looking tough i should have pulled my camera out and recorded her. that's what i should have did but i'm looking at you man i'm like no man like on, i started jumping through the storm because <laughs> she started but I, ain't I ain't even talking to you i said who the is you talking to i said what did i say what are you talking to me what did i say what did i say Girl, you, you, you look stupid, you sound stupid. 
Because if it had been a man, yeah, I'd have been over there just that quick. But I'm like, it's too. I don't women. care if it's a man or not. But, you know, I ain't wanting to, like, just come over there and, like, hey, woman. But no, I, you weren't supposed to say I, nothing. I, I that was going to come over there. That's why I was watching and seeing. You weren't Taking supposed to say nothing. Because <laughs> what I'm about to do is snatch a hole in somebody's daughter. Looking all. Ooh, let me stop. Let me go down for real. Wait, what you need, Jazz? A pen or a what? I need a pen or a pen. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What? <laughs> Wait, is that loud? A what? Who's that? You need a what? A pen? <laughs> <laughs> Chicago, she need a pencil. <laughs> because it's like, I swear, my baby was five years old when we left Chicago. So, the way she talked definitely came from home. It From us, like our household. She got that from Jack, from Oshi, me, and Greg. And there's no way at five we left and went to Vegas. It, we lived in Vegas in a predominantly white school neighborhood. <laughs> she was in a predominantly white school. She started to speak proper English, and like that was her that was her language. We changed her language because she had been in Chicago long enough to be saying pencil and some of the other stuff that she be saying, y'all. <laughs> that just tickled my funny bones. <laughs> I need a pen or a pencil. <laughs> If you're from Chicago, if you're from Indiana, if you're from Ohio, and maybe Wisconsin, y'all can relate. Y'all know what I'm saying. That's just how we talk. We know it's pencil, but that's not how we say it. We say pencil. <laughs> On the road, and there's Bucky's. We're not getting briskets though today. Right now, it is time for to handle some business. So, taking a little mini, mini road trip, and I'll see y'all when we get there. Hey, y'all. Okay, so we made it here. I'm at one of the trailer parks, and we are about to go inside and see what they got because we're still continuing on this journey. Come on, let's go. Coco, you look like you fit right in. This is not what I expected. I, so, is all of this coming with? Yes. This is what I'm looking at is what, wow. Oh my God, I wasn't expecting it to be this big. There's two entrances? What? And they tubs, you are falling in love with their tubs. All of them be having some good tubs. Oh, okay. The closet is a little small. Oh my God, this is mine. That's yours? Coco fit. Oh, look at that. Just sit on me. No, no, don't. Please don't. Okay. This got a shower in the hood. I wasn't expecting that either. Wow. Okay. Okay. Oh, see, this one's really small. This is an office, for sure. That's like office, office size. A nice top too. Yeah. Oh, this one not bad size. Let me see that closet open. Okay. Okay. Yeah. This one is this one is much larger, but I actually like the sink over there better. Are there customizable options? Not on the ones that I've shown you so far, but we're gonna go to some that you can. 
Okay. We're gonna make this quick because I, I need to focus. I can't. Okay, that's one room. That's bigger. Two rooms. Bigger. Yeah, I like the other one better. It's more modern. Yeah. Okay, so this is three bedrooms or four. What's that? No, this is four bedroom. This four. This a four bedroom? Four bedrooms, two baths. Oh, do they make doubles and three? Uh, yes, they do. However, it would be the same price essentially for this one because they, they do sell it in a three or four bedroom. Yeah. And it's like it's the same price. Yeah, you just kind of get larger spaces. Yeah. In. Okay, that makes sense. Uh oh, this is big. This is big. This is, it has. No double sinks. Ooh, I'm feeling this. And it don't have a tub and shower. Me too. You got a bigger closet though. Walk-in closet. Shower. And tub. Uh -oh. Shower and tub. Actually nice. This is a very large master. What did y'all see? This is the living room. That's what I'm saying. It's not at all. But like he ooh, look at that. But like he said, you gotta find where you're putting it. Oh, the pantry. Oh, this is really nice. Oh, that's nice. Does this built-in come in this pantry? Okay. Perfect. This is nice too. It has a farm sink. Like and a patio. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Look, they already got that big TV ready. Um, yeah. Whatever. Yeah, like, you know. This is a. Oh, uh, guess. Oh, this is the the other bath. Mm -hmm. So this one got three rooms as well. I think it's four. Let me see. Yeah. Oh yeah, I think oh, that's, so, yeah, that's two rooms. Yeah. It's, it's the three bedroom. Mm -hmm. Oh, this, this is the coat closet. And, I mean the, what do you call, I forgot what you call this. I forgot what you call this, I, I don't know. I know. Bedroom for 180, same. Oops. Double hundred eighty thousand, something like this. This has a long hallway. I'm coming. Oh, open space. Oh, nice size room. You need your own land for this. Oh, they got the smart uh, thermometers. So that's one room, two room, three. And th this whole side of the house shares a bathroom. What time is it? You know, people getting off. Oh, and this is the fourth room. Oh, okay. And then your 
laundry and mud room. Back door. This is huge. It's back. Oh, I do too, but I'm gonna wait. Tell you. Oh, you sure? Okay. Yeah. So, y'all, Curtis about to go get something to drink. And, um, oh, the AC is beaming. I'm sorry, y'all. It is hot. Uh, but, so I just wanted to know what did y'all think about what I showed y'all. I feel like I was rushing. The reason why I was rushing is because. Um, I came in a little late and they were closing, but it was very necessary for me to get this done today because, yeah, I asked a lot of questions. Y'all know, I really don't know much about trailers because I've never lived in one and I've never considered living in one. So I had a lot of questions and what i learned so far and maybe one of you guys might want to know as well is that if you purchase a trailer in one state that trailer must stay in that state why because of all of the building regulations so if i decide to leave texas i could no longer well, I could rent it. I could rent it where it is. Rent it out where it is, but I can't take it with me and rent it where I am. I would have to, it would have to stay in the same state. That is vital information because you guys, Texas is not my last stop. Um, well, I'm sorry. Houston is not my last stop. I don't know yet what moves I'm going to make, but that's years down the line. So I try not to even think about that right now. I'm focusing on what I'm trying to do while I'm here and focusing on when I'm not here, what needs to be done. So I learned that. I learned that you have to have, maybe I need to just do a whole video on this. You have to have a place to put the trailer. So if you buy a trailer and you don't own your own land, then you have to be prepared to move into a community. If you move into a community, that community has to be accepting the size trailer that you have. So they have double wide, that last one I showed y'all was a double wide trailer with five bedrooms. That trailer is much bigger. I need to stop calling it trailers because if you look at a trailer on the truck, they're all the same size. So these are manufactured homes. That manufactured home is larger than a standard double wide trailer, uh, manufactured home. So if you decide to go to a community, you have to find a community that's accepting one that size. And he said in Houston, they're not manufactured home friendly. So they're not allowing you to live like within the city and off the city water. You would have to move outside of Houston, like here, where we came to look at some homes, some brand new ones, because I can't do the whole, I don't, because I don't, because this is not something that I'm used to doing, I don't want to just jump head on and, you know, run into problems. So I'd rather start with brand new. It comes with central air. It comes with uh, central heat, everything. I feel like they look nice and I could easily get it rented. Like if somebody looked at it, saw it, it would blow their mind. And then when they come to it, they will realize oh, it's a manufactured home. You wouldn't even believe it, right? These are so beautiful. But with all of the information that I got, with everything that I learned, I feel like, I feel like I don't, I have a lot to think about. 
because I may end up having to buy like two at once. Like, I got a lot to think about. The prices, y'all saw the prices. The prices are amazing. Good prices. The only thing is, um, the only thing I feel like I need to do now is like just do a little digging and a little more research on the builders to see, you know, you know, to see um, what reviews and what people who already purchased from them are saying. <sighs> but y'all, it's a lot to think about, but I'm not giving up. I need to find the most cost efficient way for me to start making money outside of me doing the work. So yeah, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below about the stuff that you've seen. I'm excited, I hope you guys are excited for me. And uh, yeah, if you are already on this journey, link with your girl, let's talk, let's collab. I don't believe in competing i don't believe in competing broke people compete the people at the top they collab you feel me so yeah that's what i'm on so link with your girl if you're on this journey let's put our brains together no i'm not looking for a business partner i'm not looking for that but you know you can do you i do me and we come together learn from each other teach each other things you know whatever whatever reach out to your girl when Curtis come back I do want him to let y'all know what he think about it um Curtis is like we need to buy one of these we need to move in there I don't think I've crossed that bridge yet but um y'all already saw what Coco thought Coco was claiming rooms she thought it was for her baby this her closet this her bathroom Coco was not playing with y'all okay so yeah, I don't know. Down now that that's out the out of the way, I do need to go do a little bit of shopping. I want to find me some, like me and Coco, some like sundresses. And I know y'all like Nikki. If you don't get off that leg, baby, I am about to. I promise I am. But I, these things they gotta be done. Oh. So I'm thinking about just oh you know what Culver Coco we love Culver in the house by itself. Oh man. I think I'ma run to Home Depot real quick. And I was supposed to go to Walmart. Walmart Flex! Walmart first. So I don't know y'all. I don't know. I don't know exactly what I'm about to do just yet. But I'ma bring y'all with me. I, I do need to, I'm still trying to find a mop pail. The kind that you push down to squeeze the mop because sis don't squeeze mops. I'm not squeezing nobody's mop. And ain't not never. So yeah, we gotta go to Home Depot for that and then I don't know. I probably have to go home and get Culver before going to a grocery store. And when I got Culver, y'all, it'd be hard to vlog. I do not be vlogging because I don't like to leave him locked up too long. And his mom won't be back until later tonight. So, so yeah, I don't want to do that to my little mans. Mom. So we probably go back and get him. Should we? Should we go home and get Culver? Yeah. We should. You want him to come with us? Okay, made it to Home Depot, and we made it to Home Depot. Let's go try to see if we can find us a bucket. <laughs> Do you ever go away? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, y'all, let's go. Building too. Find down one of these aisles, and got a lot of people. Now I'll go back up. Find my own way.
Forty six. Forty nine down here. What the hell? Uh -uh. Maybe they outside. Oh, yeah, see this say 55. We probably was supposed to turn. 48, see? 49. Ooh, girl, your child need to be clean, baby. This ain't no, this is garbage. That ain't no my pill. Right there, there they go, boom. This okay. is what we're looking for. <laughs> Thank you. How much is it? I know. Thank you. <laughs> Ouch. Is that the biggest, the smallest one they got? Jesus. Yeah. That's the one we'll take. The smallest one. How many quarts? 31 quarts. See, they don't even offer this one online at all. They only offer that one. Coco, it's okay. It's okay, baby. It's all right. Monster! Yeah. These are the type of mop buckets I like, you guys. I ain't squeezing out no mop. Okay. So this is what I do. Okay, I was about to go home, but I need one more thing, y'all. I need some primer for that ugly painting y'all see in my kitchen. So ugly. I need to prime that. I was supposed to been painted it, but until I paint it, I want it to just be primed and white and like not that ugly color because that color is bad. Y'all know, y'all seen that paint. How about I show y'all when I get home, just in case y'all didn't. That paint is ugly. So, I'm looking for some primer. See, this is paint and primer. I just need primer. And this is the brand that I always use, y'all. I only use bare paint. Not premium plus per se, but just this brand of paint. This one is a paint and primer. Which is good, but I don't know if I wanna spend that right now so if i could spend less with just a primer then that's what i'll get but if i have to i just go ahead and get the paint and primer and turn it white we're at home and i forgot to get curtis opinion so what did you think about the uh manufactured homes we was looking at There's some new houses need to come down on their price. Cause if you got mobile homes making your house looking like some type of way, I think these houses need to up up. <laughs> up no. their house. Like these houses, I mean these, these mobile homes look so good to the point you like, I don't think I want a house no more. I think I want a mobile home. Cause some of them double wide you seen, like the tubs and the I think the countertop throw me off. Cause a lot of the countertop that I like, the little countertop. I like it. Like, yeah, I love the, the, the countertop. Like, the double wide we went to go look at. Um, and I think because it's like, it's upgraded and it's more, you know, up, more modernized, I guess. I, I guess, like, it's, it's more upgrade. Like, it's more, like, up the style. That's what I like about it. Okay, y'all remember that ugly picture? There you go, right there that I had to hang it up so it can just go somewhere but I had to come and sit down because I was gonna show y'all what I picked up from Walmart and HEB it wasn't a really big haul I only spent like a hundred and eighty some dollars so between the two stores so it's not that big of a haul so like it's really nothing to see. I got stuff for tacos, some stuff for some spaghetti, some potatoes. So we can have baked potatoes with the steak that we're having. I got some miscellaneous stuff. Um, 
some hoagies and stuff to make sandwiches. Uh, what else? Did I get? Mm, some fruits, pineapples to be exact, and like, uh, yeah, that's it. And I got this meal simple. I heard that this chicken sandwich, this chicken salad is really good. So I wanted to give it a try. It's a rotisserie chicken salad. And then it come with a little salad Mommy, on the side. So I'm gonna give it a try and see what they do. What is it? Oh, put it in the refrigerator. But yeah, um, that's that. Let me show y'all this picture. Yeah, okay, maybe I shouldn't be getting up. 